Good morning. Oh, God. Well, I just got back into bed after turning off the fan and taking out my retainers because y'all didn't need to see that. But as you saw, it's 637. Well, now it's 639 because it's been like two minutes. But the reason why I'm waking up this early on a Sunday <laughs> is because... I decided last night that I'm going to start going back to a gym, like an actual gym, not the gym that's at my apartment complex. So with the move and everything, my last gym at my apartment complex, it wasn't like fully equipped, but it had like cardio machines, a couple weight machines, and then I brought my own weights in as you guys saw. But I have just realized at home workouts are just not for me. Like I don't see progress doing at home workouts. I also find it challenging because I do have neighbors and I don't want to be that person who's like doing a burpee and they're like below me being like, girl, what's up because my last apartment I lived on the second floor and yeah I still like I moved to a place that where I live where someone is below me so I'm very cognizant of like I can't do jumping jacks I can't do jump rope I can't do burpees I can't do step ups um also my current apartment complex I live in a community of elderly people the gym here is it's very claustrophobic and it ha like all the machines are like there's like four machines they're all like really really close to each other and it's not a lot of equipment and so I haven't gone to that gym it also makes me feel very claustrophobic I don't like being in really tiny spaces like it like truly I get claustrophobic I hate being in elevators it's not my favorite thing I get worried that I'm gonna get stuck like ugh, it's bad so I like debated for a week and I was like you know what I'm gonna go to the gym so I found a gym that's near me that's very affordable and I'm gonna do um they have like a trial for like the first few days or whatever where it's free and then you can sign up and that's what I'm gonna do so I've been talking to you for like six minutes and I'm gonna get ready and go to the gym and we're gonna we're gonna do this together I'm excited because it means I'm gonna have routine again I'm nervous because I haven't been to a gym in a long time with other people there like my last gym at my apartment complex there were some people there but it was also a very tiny gym this gym is like a place that you have to pay to go in you know and so obviously there's gonna be people there so yeah surprisingly I feel very awake which I guess is a really good thing and my skin is looking really good I did a clarifying mask last night and a hydrating mask but it's neither here nor there let's get ready to go to this gym
did it. I went to the gym for the first time in a long time and it was great. Just a roundup of my thoughts because I have to get ready really quickly to go to church now because I'm going to the early service but I'm also like doing a day date with myself. I'm taking myself places where I want to go. <laughs> you gotta date yourself. You gotta know what you like. Because, you know, self-care and also dating yourself is, like, great. But anyways, I really like that gym. Something that I should mention is that as a woman of color, a person of color, it's very important that I feel safe where I go. And for me, I just realized that, like, working out at home is not very effective for me, but also walking in neighborhoods, I don't fully feel safe because I live in Colorado. Colorado is predominantly, like, a white, dominated state. There are people of color, but it's in, like, little pockets. But predominantly, like, it's not extremely diverse. Like, it's a lot of white people, which is... You know, it is what it is, but with, like, everything that happened in 2020, the political climate, like, some people just kind of came out of their shells in a violent way that I just didn't appreciate. Even when I would go on, like, walks in my neighborhood, I had instances where I was, like, followed by police, I was followed by some people, and I would have to stop for a while, and I would have to change my route. And ultimately, I just don't feel safe, like, walking outside, especially in neighborhoods, um, just because I'm concerned for my safety as a woman of color, as a person of color, as a black person. So, I, my new place, like, I live by trails, and I've been walking that, but it's a very short trail, and it's not, like, heavy traffic, and I usually wait till, you know, the sun kisses the earth, because I don't want people to get suspicious just because I see a dark figure walking early, early in the morning, um, which is what I want to do. I want to work out really early in the morning, but I can't like go out for a walk like that. And also because I live above someone, I don't fully feel like comfortable doing like a full blown out workout at home. So for me, like going to a gym is just like honestly the best option and it was nice at this gym i saw like several people of color so i felt really safe and it was very friendly the gym was very clean especially if you go early to this gym it wasn't a lot of people it's very spacious it's it's more it's a very open concept uh kind of gym so the gym that i went to before was planet fitness and there was like an area where it was where it was like a little bit more closed off like you had to kind of enter into a room um essentially like it there was no doors but like it was kind of hidden so you can kind of like be by yourself and i really appreciated that because then i can like film <laughs> myself at the gym but this is very much like an open concept so i was really like hiding my camera because i just like get really nervous filming in public like i I'm just not there yet to film openly in public and not have like an, an issue with it. It was a little awkward. I was like using water bottles and weights to kind of like hide the camera, but I was only just trying to show like my workouts and stuff as you guys saw. So I think after the, the free trial, it's like several days of free trial, I'm just gonna sign up. It's really affordable too. Like they have it's it's very similar pricing to planet fitness i'm not going to go to a gym that cost me 50 dollars. i just i can't do it i tried that for like a month or two a long time ago and it just like it's just so much money and i'm like you can get the same amount if not better service for cheaper at other places and the fact that i found one that's so close to my house it's just great so yeah, I think I'm going to go to this gym. I really like it. I'm going to continue with the free trial for the remainder of this week. And I feel like this is just the change that I needed was to be able to go to a place, work out, challenge myself. During my ab exercise, I thought I was going to throw up. No lie. Just because like it, it's been so long since I've moved my body like that early, but also... I've had a lot of coffee the past week. 
<laughs> and it was very acidic so things were just like moving around like yes it's an empty stomach i work out on an empty stomach i can't work out on a full stomach because i get hella nauseous but if i have a lot of like coffee throughout the week or caffeine throughout the week the acidity kind of like piles up so i really have to like not have a lot of coffee or caffeine in general because your girl's body just be like getting nauseous on its own so now that i'm working out again it's like okay you really can't have coffee like how you were you have to stick with like tea lattes anyways i'm like babbling but i'm just also like extremely excited that i found a gym that i feel comfortable with i feel safe and also I feel like I can like really push myself now because I couldn't push myself at home. I just don't have that luxury to like live on the first floor and you know, be as loud as I want, do burpees, have all the space. It, it be my own space because I have a roommate so I have to be cognizant of that. Like I can't be like super loud as well. Not that I am loud, but it's just like, you know, if I'm tired or whatever, or you know, if I'm really trying to push myself, sometimes I like, I don't grunt, but I just like, I'm like, you know, and that's just like a weird sound to hear early in the morning from a roommate who's trying to sleep at a normal hour. So yeah, anyways, I'm really excited to be back at the gym. I feel great. Like my endorphins kind of like kicked in. I feel amazing. I'm now going to go home, shower, get ready for the day take myself to church and then take myself on a date today i've never taken myself on a date before well actually i have i've i have taken myself on a date before it's been a really long time since i've done that so i'm just like i feel like i can conquer the world also the people at this gym were just really nice like i got a i got a mini tour i was just like i just need a quick tour to just know where everything's at and know how to access certain things i'm just really really excited but yeah, if you made a sense of this video, please do give this video a thumbs up. If you like any part of this video, subscribe so you can keep up to date with me and all the things that I'm doing and comment down below. Say hi. I say hi back. And don't forget to stay kind, stay true, and stay laughing. I mean, my face, I look hella puffy. <laughs> but that's okay. But yeah, don't forget to stay kind, stay true, and stay laughing. And I will see you guys in the next one. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Okay, bye.